I'm back. <laughs> I got the wound here. Um, I always leave a little extra length here. So I'm not going to cut this. Well, I'm going to cut the loom, but I'm not going to cut the wire. Oh, and that just came off. Why? That ground doesn't want to stay on there. That's not good. All right, we have to figure this out here. Wait a minute. Where's that coming from? Oh, that's coming from the butt, from the front. I need to cut this. I like the plastic loom versus the cloth. I think it lasts longer. And it's not expensive. off makes it easier to get in there maybe it's not all the way through they made it a little longer hmm where the heck is it uh, there it is I was pretty close so I'll hang that out a little bit so I got my red and my green wire that to get through there. Just feeding this down into the uh, the alternator. I think. trick to doing this you can do it with a with a socket wrench open end maybe I should just do that uh, uh, got to get an open end socket there you go and you stick this I do this before. Hmm. All right, let's try it this way. Hey, I got it. Well, look at that. So I don't know where this green goes. I gotta figure all this out. Ow. And we got the red. Uh, I gotta cut the end off. Gotta cut the end off of this. I might use those for something else. That's why I left a little extra on there. Uh-oh. 
a dead end here. Should be through. Probably should cut this loom right about there. All the way down to the alternator. There we go. Okay. So we got our, the only one I'll have is a yellow. The yellow's down there. I'll have to figure that out with the wiring. Okay, I'm not going to, uh, I already showed you how to do the plugs. This, this plug goes on the same way. The only difference is it's a male, a male connector. Uh, check back and uh, we'll see if this thing fires up. Catch you later.